Thanks for staying tuned to First Alert 25. I'm meteorologist Josh Johns. If we look at your updated forecast, we're watching Tropical Storm Beta very closely, now sitting in the Gulf of Mexico, trying to strengthen just a little. Going to be heading towards that upper Texas coast where you see the tropical storm warnings in effect, and that could have a big impact on our forecast by the time we head towards the middle of the week. Let me show you what that looks like here on Future Track. Because Saturday will be nice and clear. We'll see plenty of sunshine going through the rest of the evening and on into the overnight hours. Things should stay pretty clear. Going into Sunday, we may see a few high clouds working in. And then by the time we head into the afternoon, clouds will start to work in from southeast to northwest with the circulation of that storm getting closer to the Gulf coast and that means we could see a little bit more moisture work in potentially a few rain showers in the Brazos Valley and east of I-35. By the time we get into Monday, it should be pretty cloudy and then Monday in the afternoon we'll see showers and thunderstorms start to spiral around what will be beta there on the Texas coast and bringing us some rain chances and that'll last on into Tuesday and Wednesday as well. I think the best chance of rain coming up will be Monday and Tuesday. We'll stay nice until those clouds move in. A crisp night on the way with temperatures falling down the upper 50s, lower 60s by the time you wake up in the morning. And then tomorrow before those clouds work in, I think we'll see the lower 80s Maybe a few mid 80s, some of our western counties, but you could already be dealing with the 70s down in the Brazos Valley and then 70s will work in for everyone. Not as cool Monday morning with upper 60s on the way. And then the clouds are going to be a big limit on our temperature. I think we'll be able to muster the mid 70s by the time we head into Monday afternoon. Here's a look at what that 10 day forecast looks like. Because again, Sunday will be all right for the first part of the day. Want to get outdoors, do it Sunday morning and maybe Sunday in the early afternoon. Evening, we may have to deal with a few showers. Then we head into Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and we'll watch the tropics very closely. The track of that storm is going to have a big impact on our rain chances right now. I have the rain chances at 50%, of course, if it looks like that track gets a little bit closer to Central Texas or a little bit closer to the Brazos Valley, we'll up those rain chances. If it stays out to sea, we get to lower them a little bit. But otherwise, it looks like mid-70s on the way, 30 to 20% chances of rain Wednesday and Thursday, and then things should start to dry out as we head towards the end of the week. Friday night football all looking fine in the mid 80s and then as we head into next week could be dealing with a cool front working in so a lot we're going to be watching in the weather department hope you'll keep it right here on first alert 25 for updates and we'll keep you updated that's a look at your updated 10-day forecast thanks for staying tuned to first alert 25 i'm meteorologist josh johns